Hello, welcome to yet another episode. Today I will be showing you how to make a simple vanilla cake at home. I will explain how we're going to use the uh, how we can use a weighing scale or measuring cups. So either if you have a weighing scale, good for you. If you don't have a weighing scale, you can still use the measuring cups. So the first step before we go to our ingredients, it's preheating your oven. Ensure you preheat your oven at 180 degrees before you start preparing your ingredients. Next step, ensure you grease your baking tin very well and ensure that it is ready to put your cake. Another step, ensure your ingredients are fresh. Now like this one, we have our wheat flour. It's um, two cups or 230 grams. It's all sealed and ready for use. Here we have sugar, 210 grams or one cup. Here we have our uh, eggs, there are six of them, very fresh. You beat your eggs separately to ensure that they don't, uh, any spoiled egg doesn't mess up your mixture. Then we have our uh, margarine, 160 grams for one cup. Next we have our baking powder, it's 11 grams or one tablespoon. Next we have vanilla extract, it's one tablespoon. Yeah, so first step, we are going to mix our uh, our wet ingredients. So we're going to put all our wet ingredients in our mixer. So there we have. So for the measuring cups, this is what I've used. For weighing, you use a weighing scale. Any brand of weighing scale is okay. So either way, but the most appropriate, if you're baking, especially for commercial purposes, always use the weighing scale. So now I'm going to put on our mix, uh, our mixer to mix the the wet ingredient first. Now after I've mixed them together, I add now the dry ingredients to the wet ingredients. So I'm going to put a low speed so that they mix slowly, then I increase the speed as we progress and let them mix. Actually, I will let them mix for five minutes. There they will be ready, so I will just uh, put it in the So our uh, cake butter is ready, it's well mixed. So the next step now we're going to put it in our baking tin. So here we have our cake butter ready, it's well mixed, so we are going to put it in our baking tin. Just pour using a spatula. Yes, now our cake butter is ready in the tin, now you ensure that you level it very well using a spatula, just level it. So and then just level it well. So there we are. Here it is, ready for our oven. So we're going to put it in the oven that has been preheated and then check on its readiness after 50 minutes. So our 50 minutes are over. So I'm going to 
uh, open the oven and check whether our cake is ready. Just so you check your the readiness of your cake by inserting a knife or a skewer. You see now like how has, has come out clean. If it comes out clean, you know your cake is done. If it, it comes out with some residue, you take it back and add some minutes. Yeah, so our cake is done. It comes out so nicely. Very good height. So now I'm going to leave the cake in the tin for 10 minutes. After that, I remove it and put it on a rack. Uh, this is how you remove your cake. Now after it has cooled, you pass the knife around the edges. Then you put it on a rack, on a cooling rack to cool. Then you can, if you want to decorate your cake, you wait for two hours for it to cool completely. So in our next episode, I will be showing you how to decorate a simple vanilla cake using with the cream. Keep it locked for more episodes. Please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow us on Instagram, and like our page, Beldina's Delicacies. Till next time, bye!